All right, sack lunch football here. Looking at Alabama's offense, okay? Bill O'Brien, the offensive coordinator, calling plays with Bryce Young under center, okay? Right here, he's in the gun, okay? They're in a two-back look, and they're running slant flat into the boundary. So the weak side of the field, they're going to run a slant flat concept, okay? This is a staple in football at the high school, college, and pro level, okay? Especially when you get in the red zone. You'll hear announcers talk about rub routes or pick routes. It's the same thing. It's a slant flat concept. There's just numerous ways to get there and do it, okay? The whole goal in it right now, number one is always going to run a slant, okay? He's going to run a slant route. He could run it at two steps, at four steps, okay? And attack that area on an angle. The number two receiver, or in this situation be the running back, is running a flat route. You are reading the flat defender, okay? The flat defender in this situation is going to be this defensive end. He's going to drop back, okay? Bryce Young is going to read him. If this flat defender takes away the slant and drops, he's going to throw the flat. If this flat defender goes ahead and runs and takes away this flat route, then you're going to throw the slant right behind him, okay? So let's take a look at the slant flat, and then we'll get into a little bit more of the, the pre-snap movement that Bill O'Brien dials up. So here's the flat defender, okay? As soon as he drops, Bryce sees him twist and turn. When he turns right there, he's able to throw the slant behind him, okay, for a big gain. Here's the flat route. Here's the slant. Now, when you do a lot of this movement, it sounds great, but if you can't be in position, Bryce Young's going to pick you apart. He's reading him the whole way. As soon as he turns those hips, he knows this defensive end, by the time he drops back and opens his hips, he's got no chance to make this play. Reading the flat defender, throws a slant right behind him. That's a good discipline read by Bryce, fitting in a nice window, reading that defender with the slant inside, yards after catch for a big game for Alabama. Now, let's look at the motion, what they do. They start in two back, okay? When you motion before the snap, watch these linebackers, okay? They're in an under front to the field, so you got a one technique, which means your linebackers are going to be spaced out originally, okay? When you space them out, you run a sit rat right here and a sit rat right here. When you sit, you freeze and you hold these linebackers. Remember, you're trying to push him to run in this slant, this flat underneath. When you run that motion, watch the safeties. Watch all these guys move in motion, all with that pre-snap motion by Bill O'Brien to hit a slant flat on the back side, okay? Now, let's take a look at it on the board, okay? This is just what you saw happening right here, okay? They were in two back. They motioned. They put a sit rat right here. They put a sit rat right here. These safeties all moved because they motioned before the snap. All that movement did was create a window right here, back here, and even get yards after catch. This is defensive end that dropped back to that area. Bryce Young was reading him. Number one, push the corner and run the slant right behind him who had his window. Number two receiver was the running back who ran the flat route right here. Good read by Bryce Young, stayed in there, but even better designed by Bill O'Brien with the pre-snap motion.